Hey, Chad here with another uh, proof of concept, and uh, this time it is RFID tags or radio frequency identification. Um, so I've been messing around with something called Arduino, which is a programmable uh, microcontroller, so I can build my own hardware for Jarvis to connect with and, and talk to uh, things around in the physical apartment. So uh, I've actually built the first thing I built here is the RFID tag reader, and this is an RFID tag um, and basically it's the same thing as a credit card just completely blank as you can see uh, I can just throw this in my wallet now what I can what I set this up to do is that when I press this tag against the RFID tag reader it will uh, register it and then turn the lights on or come out from coming home it's the exact opposite so I'll show you for example so I'm going to take the tag here have a good day Chad, speech has been disabled. And as you can see, the lights went off and uh, you can't really see anything anymore. But this is what happens when I tell Jarvis that I'm leaving the apartment. He sets everything up for me. So I'm going to go ahead and swipe that card again. And it does the opposite. Welcome home, Chad. So what I can do is I can put this little uh, credit card thingy uh, into my uh, wallet and just swipe my wallet on the way in or the way out of my apartment so I can notify Jarvis when I'm coming or when I'm leaving and he can set up the lights and uh, all the stuff to kind of autonomously configure my home for when I'm away and when I'm home. And uh, it's kind of a cool concept. I can set up uh, multiple ID tags. It can be little credit cards like this. They can go on your keychain. They can be stickers. They can, you can stick on mugs or uh, any object around the apartment. And uh, I can set up any one of these ID tags to run any function within the Java system. So I just want to show you that proof of concept. And uh, stay tuned for more.